What's up, Cigar Junkies? It's your boy Carson, also known as Ashhead, and I am the Cigar Junkie. And I am back with another great Black Lion Luxuries 100 Reasons Why You Should Be in the Club on Ashhead TV today. And guys, here we go, another month. And it seems like, man, right here at the first of the year, these months are just flying by. We're now at month four of the new year, fastly approaching the one year anniversary of Black Lion Luxury, which is only about two to three months away. I remember it like yesterday, getting my first Black Lion Luxuries box in the mail and from that very point in the club i was hooked not gonna recap all of the 100 reasons why um that i talked about in the past videos i'm not gonna give a whole lot of reasons why in this video i just want to talk about one reason and the one most important reason is the members of the club because we the members are the ones that make this club so great. But first things first, guys, let's talk about what's in the box. Ron Real had, did a great live and he showed us what was in the box prior to. I'm just gonna recap on that a little bit and show you guys what's in the box. If you not have, have not yet gotten your box or not yet seen what's in the box or if you're still looking for a reason to be in the club, Hopefully, by showing you what's in the box on this video, it'll help you make up your mind as to what's in the box. Man, we got a treat up in here with the Placentia Almo Fuente. This is the six toe or however you're supposed to say that, um, but it's the Hexagon 6x60 as well as the LFD 1994 Roomba. This is one of my favorite cigars that I can't never find. <laughs> as well as the La Galera, Connecticut in the tube. That's pretty, that is an awesome presentation. La Galera is an awesome company too. Shout out to Ben. And the Warp Car Toe. Man, this is the one we'll be smoking right out of the right out the box, right off the truck. As you guys know, I always smoke my cigars right out the box, right off the truck, baby. Hey, guys, just a little bit about the cigars that's in the box this month. Like I mentioned, the Placentia Armo Fuente, and as always, let me just stop, pause. As always, they always include a printout of all the cigars. And you can get all the details of your cigars as to the wrapper, binder, filler, even what flavor notes that you can experience in those particular cigars. So I've ran through the cigars one time. I'm going to reach for the cigar that I'm going to be smoking out of the box. And I'm going to review this cigar right now on this Black Line Luxuries. 100 reasons why unbox we are back and i have my cigar lit just to let you guys know that with black line luxury you can smoke your cigars right out of the pack with the humi smart packaging that they have in the box your cigars are fresh 
on arrival no having to sit into your humidor allowing those cigars to acclimate but guys we're talking about the 100 reasons why you should be in the club and we're gonna just highlight one of the reasons in this video and that is the members of the club i want to tell a quick story right quick some weeks ago um i posted a video and there was a comment on the video that somebody made not going to get into the details of the comment but get into the details of the response to the comment. The response to the comments were mostly made by the members of the club and the members of the club put their capes on instantly and stood in the gap for Black Line Luxury Cigar of the Month Club in order to prove with examples and their experiences of how great the club is hey guys <clears throat> i know you guys hear james i know you guys hear run and i know you hear them both harp on the members of the club and that we make the club and this is what the club is all about the members and they are not just saying that they are not just shooting us some bull those guys are telling the truth because the members are truly what makes this club all that because we are the ones who push run, who push James in order to bring us great cigars. Date month after month after month, bringing us those great cigars that we love so much. But guys, right off the truck, I'm smoking the Warp Carto. Um, this is a four and a half by 46 ring gauge cigar. It is a Nicaraguan Puro with Nicaraguan Corojo 99 wrapper, Nicaraguan binder, and Nicaraguan Corojo 99 and Sorello 98 fillers in this cigar. And guys, it has started off just fabulous. I mean, the cigar was just right fresh out of the pack it wasn't too squishy like it had been overly humidified and it wasn't dry the wrapper um, didn't have any cracks in it or anything like that and the cigar obviously has been put together very well from the manufacturer of this cigar and it has started out great man i get some saltiness um on the tongue initially from this um cigar and some pepper kind of like a salt and pepper um thing going on here right at the beginning of the cigar really a little early to really get into all the flavor notes let's give all this stuff time to heat up and let's talk about this warped quarto guys right here about an inch of a way into this cigar i would argue that this is probably the most complex cigar out of this month's pack it's a whole lot of stuff going on right here only about a half of an inch in to the first third of this cigar i'm getting some pepper some saltiness i'm getting some of that dark rich chocolate like a um a 90 percent chocolate or something like that i'm getting some of that dark rich chocolate flavor notes um I am getting some of the cedar that is mentioned in the notes that you get in your Black Line Luxury Pack, pack as well. And the retro hail just opens up every flavor that I just mentioned and make them even more pronounced with a whole lot of spice at the end of that retro hail. But guys, I became a member of Black Line Luxury Cigar of the Month Club their first month, which was July. Um, 2020, if I'm not mistaken. Um, I am one of the founding members of the Black Line Luxury Cigar of the Month Club, and I have been thoroughly 100 percent satisfied with the club for day one reasons why reasons why is 
most importantly, like I said in previous videos, the cigars. And the cigars are the one thing that keeps the members happy. A lot of people like to think it's a lot of all the other stuff. A lot of people like to think it's the stories that keep the members happy. A lot of people like to think it's the um, the flash, the glamour, um, the fancy packaging. Um, like I always say, all the luxury is in the box as it comes to Black Lion Luxury Cigar of the Month Club. But the one thing that kept me as a member more than anything is the cigars the very first month was a month that was no other club on the planet can compare to the kickoff that black line luxuries gave you on their very very first month no other month can compare i'll argue that with anybody the very first month you had a um warp Maestro Del Tempo, you had a Padron 90, you had a um, Armodel, Armodel Fuente, I'm almost, am I correct? I may be, I'm not going to try to go back that far in my memory and try to guess, but just those two that I mentioned, the Warped and the Padron, that I know 100% that was in that box in addition to an Agonosa Leaf, um, guarding another form cigar that was in that box as well the kickoff was phenomenal it was like at the start of an nfl game you kick off and the guy run the ball back for 100 yards he field it and run it out all right here we go 56 yarder it's got no does not have the leg and chris davis takes it in the back of the end zone he'll run it out to the 10 15 20 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 45. There goes Davis. Oh, my God. Davis is going to run it all the way back. Auburn's going to win the football game. Auburn's going to win the football game. He ran the missed field goal back. He ran it back 109 yards. They're not going to keep him off the field tonight. Holy cow. Oh, my God. Auburn wins. Auburn has won the Iron Bowl. Auburn has won the Iron Bowl. That's exactly what the first month was. And from that point, I was a member. I knew I would be a member for life. I know there's nothing Ron or James could do to piss me off, to make me not want to be a member of the club other than put bad cigars in the club box. And you know what? I trust and believe in them enough to know that that won't ever happen. Guys, I'm going to smoke this cigar down a little bit more and I'll be right back to tell you more about my experience as a member with Black Line Luxuries Cigar of the Month Club. Guys, I am smoking along on this warped carto from Black Line Luxuries Cigar of the Month Club in their April box. This cigar has shown to me why black line luxury is the club you want to be a part of there's always outstanding cigars and there's always something that i have never smoked or even heard of before in the club block box and this is one of the cigars guys being a member of the club has its perks being a member of the black line luxury cigar of the month club all the club members are privy to a promotional code for when they go to buy other things from black line luxuries so after the first month um the club box i fell in love with the warp maestro del tiempo um fell in love with that cigar i had to have more the one that was in the first month of the club box was the um lonsdale version of it uh, it made um well no the lonsdale version of it that's right so i wanted more of that cigar so i hit up james i was i ordered i actually went just went to the website and just ordered one just ordered one cigar um because i was like gotta have another one i got i just gotta smoke it again to see 
is it just going to be just as good um, the second time around? And I ordered it and the cigar never came in the time frame that I thought it should have came in. So I hit up James. Guys, that's what makes it so great about the club, guys. If you ever run into a snag or anything, you can just reach out to the, um, the club or the business owner and you can contact him direct and he'll make everything just perfectly right. But this is, wasn't a mess up or anything like that. So I reached out to him, cigar haven't came yet. Boom, he, he contacted me back right away. So got everything squared away. And to my surprise, when I got my cigar that I wanted another of, not only did he send me one more, but he sent me two more in Lonsdale, two more in the Robusto, and another size that I don't remember may have been a Toro in the same cigar. So I got multiple sizes in that same cigar and all I wanted was one. Now, that doesn't happen all the time and nobody has the resources to do that 100 times out of 100. But, Black Line Luxury is such a great company and um, with such great representation that he wanted to make sure that I was a satisfied member. And you know what? He earned my membership for life with that. Guys, this cigar is still going amazing. When I entered the second third of this cigar, and there goes the beautiful sun kissing my melanin skin. When I entered the second third of this cigar, milk chocolate, sweet tobacco, that toastiness that's mentioned in the notes, guys, and that lets you know how good the palettes are of Run and James because in the notes that are included in your Black Line Luxury Cigar of the Month box, they are 100% of the time dead on with the flavor notes. I have never dis I've never experienced a time where I disagreed with the flavor notes. Now, there may have been a flavor note or two that I didn't get, but I'm always getting something that's on the list. like. For example, in this cigar, they have it listed that you get the chocolate. I've gotten the chocolate. They had it listed that you get the cinnamon. I've gotten the cinnamon. They had it listed that you get the um, the toast um, as well as the black pepper and the leather. I have not gotten the leather yet. I have got the black pepper. And I get the toast on the retro hill. So a lot of the notes that they put in about the cigars are just a combination of you experiencing the cigar in its fullest, smoking it slow, retro hailing, and paying attention to the um, the flavor notes that, that you are tasting when you're smoking a cigar. Now, I know everybody doesn't smoke like me. I do cigar review videos. So every cigar that I smoke, I am doing a cigar breakdown in my mind as I smoke the cigar. Everybody doesn't do that. Every, most people or the average smoker just pick up a cigar and just smoke it. Okay, the cigar tastes good. That was good enough for them. And I do understand that. But me, I am looking to see, am I getting the flavor notes that they're mentioning? Not to test their palates or put them to the test, but because I want to experience exactly what the guys who I respect their palates experience as well. So I can enjoy this cigar just as much as they enjoyed this cigar. Guys, I'm going to smoke this cigar down to the nub and I'm going to come back and I'm going to do a summary of my experience with Black Line Luxuries, which is one of the reasons why you should be a part of the Black Line Luxury Cigar of the Month Club and a summary on this great cigar that's included in the April box of Black Line Luxuries Cigar of the Month Club. This cigar has given me an excellent smoking experience. The construction on the cigar has been top notch. It has burned good throughout the entire smoke. 
Not one time have I had to do a touch up on this cigar. Not one time did my burn get a little bit crazy. And the complexity of this cigar has been outstanding. Like I said before, I will argue that this is probably the smallest and the most complex cigar in the box this month. The flavors have been bold. The flavors have been pronounced. The, um, there has been nothing about this cigar that has been harsh and nothing about this cigar that makes me want to put it down. Everything about this cigar makes me want more. I'll be giving you a call, James, of this cigar. Guys, I'm going to continue to nub this cigar out. I'm going to continue to be a member of the Black Line Luxury Cigar of the Month Club because you know what I've discovered in my smoking all the years that I've been smoking? The Black Line Luxury is the right club for me. Ashhead out.